Jenny McKinnon from PA, sorry. Um, Mr. Farage, with your um, private education, your background in banking, what, what do you personally have in common with the working class, and um, particularly working class Labour voters? Thank you, I was never in banking. Next question, please. <laughs> I did go to a private school. You can't choose your parents. You can't choose your name. They called me Nigel. Hey, um, we've got we've got another female candidate. We've got a female candidate with an even more difficult name. Uh, we can't choose these things. I tell you what. There are things that unite people across the spectrums, across the classes, across the racial divide, and indeed across the religious divide as well. And it is a belief that nation-state democracy is the right way to live your life. That only in nation-state democracy can the will of the people actually be carried out. And it's something, I think, that has progressively made us a great country. It's a model that we've transferred to many parts of the world with de uh, decolonization after 1945. And we're looked at, and we're called the mother of parliaments in this country. I mean, if this was happening, if an African country had had an election that had been overturned, there would be uproar. There'd be demand we send to the United Nations, and yet it's happening here. And I think most of our career class in Westminster think they can simply get away with this. Well, the Brexit party is here to say, you won't get away with this. Our voice will be heard, and we will win this great historic battle.